This is a video on how to control your specification properties within DriveWorks Pro. The specification properties task provides the ability to have additional columns of information appear in the specification explorer for specifications created from an active project. With DriveWorks Pro already open and a group under projects already open, go to the specification explorer task from the task explorer and view the columns that are already available to view information from. Now go to the Specifications Property task from the Task Explorer. Within the Specifications Properties task, click on Add from the command bar to add a new column to the Specification Explorer. Give the new property the name Subtotal and click on OK, as I would like to display the subtotal following the generation of each specification. Now with your new property selected, click the Build button from the command bar. This will bring up the Rules Builder, where we can enter in a rule for the property. Make the result of the rule, the subtotal, by selecting the subtotal return form control. Click on OK to accept the rule. Now go back to the Specification Explorer task and select a new specification from the command bar. Select the Product Selection project from the list in the dialog box and select OK. Run through the specification by creating yourself a new sofa and then a new shelf and then continue to go to the checkout and order your goods. When you have been directed back to the Specification Explorer, you'll notice that firstly your specification has been generated, and secondly a new column has been added which identifies your subtotal for each specification. For more information, click on the Help button any time whilst using DriveWorks Pro, or visit the online help file which can be found at docs.driveworkspro.com.